As the U.S. death toll from COVID-19 climbs past 406,000, frustration is growing over efforts to vaccinate people. CBS 4's Chris Martinez has the latest. Health department workers in Chicago received their coronavirus vaccinations right. Thursday. I think it's one of the tools that's going to help us get out of COVID. But in New York City, 15 vaccination sites are now temporarily closed because of a lack of supply. We need more vaccine and we need it now. About 23,000 New Yorkers had their vaccine appointments canceled and rescheduled for next week. It's anxiety and maybe even a little bit of a sense of panic. I don't quite understand scheduling appointments for which you didn't have doses. Here in hard hit Los Angeles County, new vaccine appointments for next week remain up in the air. County officials say that's because they don't know how many doses they will get from one week to the next. I know people would, would feel much better if we could say to them, you know, every week there will be X number of appointments for people 65 and older to get their first dose. Um, but we just can't do that because we don't have allocation numbers in advance. Former California Governor Arnold Schwarzenegger posted a video of his vaccination at Dodger Stadium. The 73-year-old action star quoted one of his famous movie lines as he encouraged others to get the shot. Come with me if you want to live. There is some positive news in the county. Hospitalizations and daily new cases are both trending down. Chris Martinez, CBS News, Los Angeles. Alabama Governor Kay Ivey extended her state's mask mandate, citing concerns over the dwindling number of ICU beds in the state. You can look for much more on the coronavirus pandemic tonight on the CBS Evening News with Nora O'Donnell. That's at 630 after CBS 4 News at 6.